Welcome to this wiring tutorial presented by AccuEnergy. In this video, we will provide a step-by-step -step demonstration on how to wire the AccuVim 2 power meter in a three-phase power system. Let's begin by looking at the schematic diagram. In this diagram, the black, red, green, and gray lines represent the three phases and neutral line respectively. We will refer to these as phase A, B, C, and N. Please note this is a standard wiring application with the current flowing from the utility side to the load side. In this demonstration, we will use corresponding black, red, green, and white wires to show the actual wiring. First of all, a current transformer should be added to each phase line, which will step down the current to desired levels. In this diagram, a donut or solid core CT was added to phase A, with the black and white wire sticking out. All wires from the CT need to be connected to a terminal block before they are wired to the AccuVim 2 power meter. Please note this is a generic CT where the letter H must face the utility side to obtain accurate readings. Here we demonstrate the connection between the CT from phase A and the terminal block. We then connect these two wires on the AccuVim 2 power meter via the current input terminals located on the bottom of the meter. The black wire is always connected to the first terminal of each phase, in this case I11. The white wire is then connected to I12. Here we are demonstrating the connection from the CT to the meter via the terminal block. The wire connection is being made in the order of black, then white. Now that we have wired the current input for phase A, the same steps apply to phase B and phase C. Be sure that phase B is connected to I21 and I22, and phase C is connected to I31 and I32 of the current input. Note that in this demonstration, the colors of the connecting wires are consistent with the colors of phase lines. For example, the red wires originate from phase B. Next, the voltage of each phase needs to be wired into the AccuVim 2 power meter. The black line connects phase A to the V1 voltage input terminal on the meter. The same principle applies to phase B and C. The neutral line is connected to the VN terminal. The power supply of the meter usually comes from the utility side. However, a UPS can also be used if needed. In this diagram, phase A is connected to the hot wire, noted as L slash positive. The neutral line is connected with the neutral, noted as N slash negative. In this demonstration, wires for the voltage input are connected to the power switch on the utility side. The voltage input terminals are located on top of the power meter. The power supply terminals are located on the right side, where the hot wire and neutral connect to phase A and the neutral line respectively. This concludes our demonstration of the basic wiring for the AccuVim 2 multifunction power meter in a three-phase power system. For questions or additional technical support, please contact us via the telephone or email address provided below. You may also download our technical brochures and user manuals by visiting our website at www.accuenergy.com.